Okay, to install the e-brake handle, what we're going to do is we're going to take one of these uh, 5 16 bolts uh, with the flange head on it. It'll go down through the, the slot here, and then this one here is uh, a hole. It'll, you'll set that down, and then the, you can see there's a little pocket right here. The handle will set down in there. We'll take one of the washers, one of the nuts, and then from the underside, you'll bolt that down. You'll use a uh, half inch wrench and a half inch deep socket. You might need an extension to get out of the pocket with the ratchet here. Tighten that down. Then what you'll do is, and I'll take this out just so that you can see it a little bit better. Then you'll take the cable which will then connect to the uh, equalizer bar so that you can uh, connect it to the other cables which we already installed. You'll set this end in the bottom hole there on the lever arm. Use the shoulder bolt, quarter 20 shoulder bolt. And this will go with the head towards the uh, center line of the car. You'll drop that in. One second here. So you'll slide that in like that with the nut on the other side. Uh, the reason why you want to do this is so that when you use the uh, 5 30 seconds Allen on the head of the bolt, it's easier to access from this side since. Um, the threaded side of the bolt will be closer to the to the wall here, so it's easier to get the wrench on this side. So you'll use the 7 16 wrench on uh, on this side, and you'll use the um, 5 30 seconds either Allen key or Allen adapter uh, socket that will go on the 3 8 drive ratchet. Then once that's all set in position, again bolted down into the pocket. You can see there's uh, two nuts on the end of the cable here. I'll take one off. and then you'll see this bracket here will slide over and then you'll put the, the nut back, back on and what you can do is then if you can come down here, if you get a look down here, you can see on the other end of the cable here there's this pressed on piece to the cable you can then slide that into the, you can see that the groove, is there's a large groove here, a large circle there you'll slide that, um, that end of the cable through there and then the cable will slide around this slot come up the corner and then it will catch. I'll show you. So it's actually easier to do this first before you put this on the end of the rod. Let that slide down through and then it slides over into the middle. You do that for both cables then take the rod, put that through the center hole, put the other nut on and uh, tighten both of the nuts down. And that's the, it for the install of the e-brake cable. Or e-brake handle rather.